Hey guys, I'm back. Now UFC 268 is right around the corner and I know that you're very curious to see who the upcoming fighters are picking for Kamaru Usman versus Colby Covington, their very anticipated rematch. But before I begin, I'm partnering with mybookie.ag. So these are the current odds for the fight as of right now. Make sure to use my promo code to receive this special offer below. Don't forget to also check out the link in the description below for more details. I hope this prediction video can help you make some strong decisions for the upcoming rematch, Kamaru Usman versus Colby Covington too. Now let's roll the video. Kamaru Usman, he is Nigel, Nigel. He will be defending his title against Colby Covington. How do you see that fight playing out? Colby the Virgin Covington, man, it, it's gonna be another. It's gonna be another nightmare for, for the Virgin Colby Covington. You know, it's funny, man. I posted a picture of my wife, and somebody, uh, somebody posted. I wonder when she's gonna be in Col Colby's middle. I was like, man, I. I, I, I let her do it because I heard Kobe, I heard Kobe pays a lot of money, dude. I'm like, dude, we got some formula to pay for, but I think it's gonna be another. Uh, I think it's gonna be another knockout by the Nigerian Nightmare. I, mean, I think he's getting he's only getting better. His his ability, his wrestling. Uh, he, he's gonna knock him out at at MSG. He's gonna put the stamp on it within the within the first or second round. Kamaru versus Kobe. Yeah. Their rematch. Who do you think wins that? I think it's a great fight. Um, I think Usman being a little bit more active, I think he's sharper, his jab, you saw his striking look really good against uh, Masvidal. I think he's only getting better. Um, there's a couple of things he did, like technically that didn't look right when he was striking with Masvidal, but I think all in all, if you assess the entire display of striking that he displayed, um, I said displayed twice, but I think all in all, I think he looked very polished and a lot better than what he has from the first time that they fought and the other guys that he's fought. So. Credit where credit's due, and I think Kobe's a tough dude, but I can't see how he wins that fight unless Usman gets tired. I mean, he's not going to outstrike him now. Before, his one time to outstrike him was the last fight. The fight got stopped. Unfortunately, I thought that it should have gone a little bit longer. I don't think things would have probably changed. I think Usman would end up winning that round, and then Usman wins that fight 3-2. to two. So that was the close opportunity that he had to win the belt. He lost. Um... I'm not sure what his approach is going to be for this time going around. If I'm Usman, I'm looking at the fight like, what's Kobe thinking in order to win this fight this next time in a couple of weeks? I think Cameron Usman is, is really, really tough for anyone on, this, on his division. And I think he's going to keep the belt. He's really water. He's really good, really tough. And I'm, maybe the only one that can give him a hard time can be Vicente Luque, I think. Uh, I'm going with my guy Usman. Come on out, you know. Um, <laughs> we just started from day one, and you know we're you know good friends and everything. I just I might be a little biased, but you know um, the first round, the first fight was very tough, but he got the finish. I think he's gonna finish him earlier this round, so no controversy. <laughs> oh man, definitely Usman. Usman's yeah. got him, man. I think he's got his number. He's evolving. He's knocked out. Just knocked out one of the best strikers in the division, uh, George Masvidal. So you know he's getting better everywhere. So it's just a different version, a better version than the last time Kobe faced him.